Hello. In this tutorial, we will have a brief overview of MediaSpace, our flagship media application, also known as KMS. MediaSpace is designed for easy content creation and sharing. I will be starting with a brief overview on how it's organized and then walk you through more functions in detail. What we are looking at here are galleries. There is Sample Gallery 1, Sample Gallery 2, and so on. Galleries are centrally curated collections of content that within the security of this application can be considered public collections. Channels, in contrast, are oriented to specific members, and you will see members are listed here. The basic functionality within the gallery or channel includes creation and playback of videos, webcam recordings, video presentations, screen captures, live webcasts, and on-demand webcasts. The basic layout involves a tiled set of thumbnails. Selecting a thumbnail opens a media page that allows me access to the content as well as its metadata and additional functionality relevant to the media. You will note that MediaSpace creates this application link to a media page, but I can also create a playlist for embedding externally in a player on any site. I can also access social features such as adding and replying to comments. I can also like a video. This functionality is true for every player page in both galleries and channels. Channels are based on membership. Members can be drawn from the internal authentication mechanism inside of MediaSpace, as well as via SSO integration with LDAP and others. I can add members to the channels that I have created and choose to assign them specific access. There are three levels of privacy, open, restricted, and private. Open means both members and non-members can not only view content, but can also contribute content as well. Restricted means every authenticated user can view the content, but only contributors can add content to the channel. Private limits all interactions with this channel to members that have access. Private channels will not show in the channel listing unless you are a member of the channel. Channels like the media assets themselves can have a title, a description, and can also have tags. This can also be oriented around topics to allow for searchability. Kaltura allows for moderation in various ways. In the context of this channel, I can have moderation associated with the upload of content to this particular channel, and depending on a user's role, they can be informed about new content that has been uploaded. We do support email notifications as well. Getting back to the MediaSpace homepage, search applies to various levels of information. There's metadata, as well as closed captions or subtitles. I can search the entire MediaSpace site, search just within the gallery, and I can also search in the video. I'm also able to sort content alphabetically by likes, comments, as well as particular type. Now let's look at the My Media section. This is my personal media collection of all the media I have uploaded via MediaSpace or any other Kaltura application like the KMC. From here, I can publish content to galleries and channels. I'm going to walk you through some of the types of content we allow for creating. Media upload basically allows you to select files from your desktop and upload. Transcoding will be automated in the cloud and the file will appear in the media section. Webcam recording engages the webcam and allows you to record directly into MediaSpace. This will generate a file in the My Media section. Video presentations allow you to map a document such as Word docs, PowerPoint, text documents, and even PDFs with a video that can be used for presentation. Here is an example of a video presentation that we have made. This is a combination of a PowerPoint doc and a video. The yellow markers are called cue points and indicate where in the presentation the slide will increment. If I press play here, you will see as the speaker begins, the slides will automatically increment as the timeline reaches the appropriate point. Screen Capture is an embedded Java application that allows you to select the dimensions and quality of the screen capture that you like. You can add a webcam overlay and it will generate content directly into the system. This has been a brief overview of our MediaSpace site. 
For more information and guides, please visit Kaltura's Knowledge Center. Thank <laughs> you.